Hey everyone, Alex from Android Central here. The very quick look at a new leaked Jelly Bean ROM for the Samsung Galaxy S3. So this is just leaked out this morning. It's not an official build. Um, it's a testing build from Samsung, but it is Jelly Bean. It is on the Samsung Galaxy S3 here. Um, so hop in the settings, we can see what we are dealing with. It's Android 4.1.1, most recent version. Um, was built about a couple of weeks ago, uh, and you've got the usual um, Easter egg thing here. Um, so in terms of actual features, there's um, not a whole lot of new stuff in here that uh, S3 owners are going to want to play with. It's uh, a fairly minor update for this phone. You've got uh, the new notification stuff up here, and you can uh, collapse and expand uh, notifications like that. Also got the new clock setup up here, that's looking very nice. Um, other than that, the usual uh, touch with stuff up at the top, and this brightness bar as well. Um, Heading back to the home screen, we can see how Google Now works on this phone. We've got this button that appears in the uh, task switching area. So Google Now is on here. It is working, uh, kind of. It's telling us you don't have the location service turned on, even though we do. So some of that's not quite functional. We do have the new voice-activated Google search, though. We can test that out. What's the weather like in Berlin? It's 23 degrees and mostly cloudy in Berlin. So there we go. That's working fine. Um... In terms of overall performance, uh, not a huge difference from ICS. I mean, the, the S3 wasn't very quick on ICS anyway, so uh, not too surprising to see that there's not much room for improvement in terms of overall butteriness on this phone. Um, some of the transitions do seem a little bit quicker, like hopping in and out of the app drawer, so there is that. But on the whole, um, the S3 is already a very fast phone, um, and Jelly Bean uh, doesn't bring a huge change in that respect. Um, so... Just take a look in the camera app. The camera is working in this build. Um, it's as fast as it ever was, just taking pictures here quickly and easily. Uh, we've got the usual features in the uh, menu here from earlier ROMs. Uh, so the launcher itself is mostly the old uh, touch with launcher from Ice Cream Sandwich. We've got a couple of new widgets like this redesigned Google search widget here. Um, but the new features like moving icons out of the way when you place down a widget, that's not there yet. Not sure if that'll be there in uh, the finished ROM, but it's certainly not present in this pre-release version. Uh, NFC features are included, uh, though they're a little bit janky in this current version. Uh, we've got the settings here. Uh, we can see Android Beam and S Beam. Um, gets a little bit confused when you try and transfer files between another Jelly Bean device. It doesn't really know whether to use S Beam or Android Beam. Uh, we expect it to be fixed before the uh, final version hits. So there you go, very quick look at an early build of Android 4.1 Jelly Bean on the Samsung Galaxy S3. Thanks for watching.